In general, melon and honeydew plants are andromanaceous, meaning individual plants bear both staminate, male flowers, and hermaphrodite, having both male and female reproductive organs, flowers. Several studies have shown that isolation of melon and honeydew plants from pollinating insects results in little to no pollination of flowers, which results in little or no crop at all. Melon and honeydew flowers can be considered self-fertile but not self-fertilizing, therefore pollen must be transferred from the anthers to the stigma by insects. Honey bees are considered the most effective pollinating insect for melon crops. Cross-pollination has also been shown to produce slightly heavier fruit. At least one viable pollen grain must be deposited on the stigma and fertilize an ovule if a seed is to be formed, thus if insufficient pollination occurs those melons with small numbers of seeds may be culled from the crop. The effective period in which pollen can be deposited on the stigma is no more than a few hours in the morning, and if the temperature is high, the period may only be a few minutes. After this period, the flowers will close and will not open again. Melon is self-fertile with the female flower being pollinated equally well by pollen from a male flower on the same or a different plant. The pollen grains are sticky and insects are required to transfer pollen to receptive stigmas. Fruit abortion in flowers bagged to exclude insects is 100% and each stigma needs 1,000 pollen grains spread evenly over the three lobes in order to form a large, well-shaped fruit. Fruit will be misshapen and devalued if even one stigma lobe receives an insufficient amount of pollen. The benefits of honeybee pollination to melon and honeydew production have been firmly established. Further studies found that pollination of melon using honey bees improved percentage fruit set and fruit weight significantly. It has been shown that honey bees are also the most abundant pollinators of watermelon with lack of pollination linked to poor yields, thus low incomes for growers. Recent studies have further demonstrated the benefit with crops pollinated with honey bees producing significantly higher numbers of mature fruits and seed yields as compared with caged plants which failed to produce any fruits at all. Recommendations for number of hives per hectare for melon Muskmelon and honeydew vary from 2 to 5 hives per ha. The bees are preparing to start a working day. Taking care of the bees every day will maintain effective pollination.
Great results after three days of pollination. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe.